All right, let's see what we've got here. Got a little problem right here. Got them little worms and they go up inside the squash. I already dig, dig one out over here. But uh, what I had to do was, see all that crap was coming out of here? Okay, don't mess with it. But uh, my little baby was sick today, so I had to come home. There's a stink bug right there. Kill him. Ugh. There you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nasty old stink bugs. Anyway, what's in here is a, it's a little worm. And what you got to do is uh, cut this out of your stalk because it's a little fat right here. So He's in here somewhere. Let them pull a happy size one out. You don't cut all the way through the stalk because he'd have killed this, probably kill this plant to do that, but maybe not. But I'll just rip it, not rip it, but so I can see inside here. Dug it out a little bit. There he is right there. I don't know if you can see that, but he's trying to go away from me. Rico havoc on you on the squash. And they burrow on inside the squash. Pretty big size worm, but kind of messed him up pretty good. Throw him out of the garden. And what I do next is um don't see no more in there. So what I do is pack that sore with some dirt. It's the only thing I got. Yeah. Try to promote some growth with some roots. I think I got one in my other stock over here. It seems like all the stocks got it in there. Like one big old worm. So that's what I'm looking for on my other stocks, and that's about it with the and little tube worms, whatever you want to call them. I don't, I'm not sure what they're called. But what you do, you'll see some crap poking out the side, uh, like sawdust looking stuff. But it's really like whatever he's eating, I guess he's pooping out or whatever. So I'll do another one. All right, I'm going to do another one. Hope you all can see it. But uh, again, you got like a little wound that is. These worms like to dig out. So I'm gonna cut. Little incision in here, vertical or horizontal, wherever it's going for you. Try to give it some give. We got a little froggy buddy over here, look at this. My little partner, kind of watch. <laughs> anyway, go on. Open up this. Vine. I mean, it could potentially harm your squash, but it's better just to see what you can do. I mean, it's already got damage, so not really going to hurt you by your hand. They see it right there. A worm. Yeah, I heard him. See him? That's what the worm looks like inside there. See how it's rotted in there? I cut it in half. I took out a squash plant. It looked like it was pretty messed up. Well, kind of broke it, but I decided to take it as a experiment. See how these worms do as an inside kind of thing. And here's what it looks like. You see the worm right there right beside there and what you can do you know you cut a slit like I showed you and 
dig the worm out, but you just got to be careful and gentle with the squash or whatever you're digging out because you can probably can ruin it and break it somehow. So just beware when you pick the worms, they can make you cause you to either they cause a problem or you're going to cause a problem to your squash plants.